Hey guys, if you've been trying to update your iPhone, I put up a touch. So let me just go right into my settings, general, so I have to update. Anyways, and if it's just stuck, maybe say it paused and then three hours, four hours, and then it went back to pause. Maybe you went again to check for updates saying that there was an error or anything like that. Any of those things happen when you're trying to update, just restart your iPhone, I put up a touch. Again, you can also update them using your computer. So on Mac, you would use Finder, and on PC, you would use iTunes. So you guys can do that as well if you really want to fix this. So again, if you get this type of message, don't worry about it. You can try again. You can close this. You can come back into it, and then you can check it out. However, at this point, what I should be doing is just restarting my phone. That's actually what I'm going to do right now. I'm just going to hold my volume key plus my power key. That's on the right-hand side. Press both of those. And we hold those until we see this. Then we're just going to slide off. And we're just going to press OK. Once we turn it back on, we can just go into settings once again. General, software update. And here we go. Just press try again. If you get any type of error like that, it's a really easy fix. Of course, we can just try again. However, this may not work for you guys. So make sure to just hook it up to your computer and use iTunes or Finder in order to make this update. Again, it's really small. What I also suggest doing, if this is really, really not working for you, just wait two days. Um, usually by the next day, it's okay. But if you wait two days, then you're pretty sure to be able to download the content. And that's because there's so many people trying to download the latest update that this keeps crashing. And that's why it crashes. It's a little bit too many people at the same time.